Infranodus is a text network analysis tool that can help you make sense visually out of complex data. So something like this, a spreadsheet with a lot of rows and columns turns into something like this, where you can visually see what are the main topics inside, how they're related, and what are the gaps between them, so you can generate new ideas. You can also categorize all the data based on the columns you choose. So for example, you can only see talks that have one type or another and see them all at the same time and look at the differences between them. Try it out on infranodus.com or keep watching to learn how it works. First of all, you need to go to the Apps menu and choose the CSV import app. Then you choose the file you would like to import. In this case, it's the presentations at the web conference 2019, the titles of the talks and the types of the sessions. So I choose the column which I want to import. In this case, it's going to be the title of the paper which is being presented. And then here it's confirmed it's the title. And then I can also choose the columns that I will use for tagging and categorizing my data. In this case, it's going to be the day when the presentation is made and the type of the presentation. Then I choose to save it in this graph. And what's going to happen is that Infranodos will take all the data from this title column, the text, and represent this text as a network where the words are the nodes and the co-occurrences are the connections between them. Like this, we can quickly see what are the main topical clusters present inside the text and how they're related. We can see them here in the menu. So we see that there is quite a lot about deep learning and using graphs for that. Here, if we click on these terms, we can see in which context exactly they appear, so which papers have the highest concentration of these terms. We can also see that the next topic is the recommendation systems here, uh, user recommender systems again, and neural network models. So we see that a lot of the content at the conference is about deep learning and neural networks and recommendation systems, which just happened in a few seconds without having to analyze the whole file. Another interesting feature is the inside panel where we can see the structural gap. So which two topics uh, could be connected but are not yet related. And the system is proposing us to ask a research question that would link these two topics together, which normally leads to very interesting and new ideas in the context of this discourse. Another feature that you might be interested in is the ability to see the different graphs for the different categories. So you remember we had this column which was showing the type of the talk. Here we can see if there is any different content, let's say in the long oral presentations here, comparing to, let's say, long poster presentation. As we can see, they're quite similar. So this shows us that uh, the people who organized the conference did quite a good job distributing the content between the different types of papers. However, if we click on the demo papers, actually, we see that uh, the content uh, diversity is much less here. So this can also indicate some interesting insights about the way papers are presented. Here, if we click on the different presentation days, Friday and Wednesday, we see that they're basically the same. There are slight differences, but the organizers did quite a good job distributing the topics evenly between all the different days. So this is how it works. You can try it out on infranodos.com and you can use it with any kind of data, a database experts, survey answers, and uh, how we just did in this case, conference topics.